has been crucial for the cause of Meralco in this series. And, and to me, that's unexpected because Kyle Pascual is not, not really known as a defensive player. Big foul, yes. And CJ Perez in attack mode early in this matchup. And when CJ is at the point guard position, meaning there's no Chris Ross, and see he's surrounded by shooters in season last year. This is Musam now attacking lefty layup is good off the glass. When they put Fajardo in that pick and roll action, very difficult for Fajardo to keep in step with the Chris Newsom. Instead, they go up top. CJ, one-hander is good in traffic. He's just he's just so good and athletic. That was a bigger player switching on, on to him uh, in, in Cliff Hodge, but CJ is still able. But they retain possession, Newsom for three. This time it's good. Junmar was so far from the rebounding position because he was involved in that ball in, screen. In, in that ball screen. And that's Five and maybe in game six. Good pass down low as CJ banks it home. Lead goes back to SMB. Ultra aggressive start here coming from CJ Perez. A lot of the. Picked up by Perez. And that's important because he will have pressure legs in, in the end game and no real reason to bring him back because San Miguel has played well without him so far in this game. Well, Coach Norman Black not happy with that last no call. He thought that Perez pushed off on the takeaway now. Perez all day to shoot and he converts from downtown. And I like it that CJ was rewarded with those three point shots because that, that turnover was really forced by CJ Perez with his excellent pressure defense on Newsom. Junmar, if he gets double teamed, you have four shooters on the floor. Newsom onto the cup as he finally. And that mini run coming from the San Miguel Beerman inching. Meralco closer, down by six. Herndon will try again, short this time. And there was a hold for Meralco. Good fake. CJ launches from deep. Finally, they hit one from the outside. Now back to back play. San Miguel has gone to CJ Perez. They went to Junmar for hard with a small lineup because of the spacing it was given to Junmar, but the shots were not back. Spins. Tough angle, oh the layup, wow, Newsom climbs for that putback jam. And he has no reaction as if nothing happened. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Just another day at the office for Chris Newsom as he has 13 points in the ball game. Strong drive that does not lead to a basket. Now to score for SMB, Brondial blocked from behind by Newsom. is really an elite defender, Chris Newsom, both on and off the ball. For yeah. UAB, but apparently he just finished his high school. But this guy is, is the next big thing, really, for, for Philippine basketball. So Sunday unit. Um, a bit of an adjustment coming from Coach Leo Austria as he has Jericho Cruz in the ballgame. Well, he see forward pass. Oh, no one. Defending Newsom for the slam dunk. Nobody running back on defense there. No one playing safety for San Miguel because it was CJ who took that shot. Oh, Newsom gets blocked by CJ. A chance now for San Miguel Beer to retake the lead. This is such a great matchup between CJ Perez and, and Chris Newsom. In game four, as he sunk 11 of 13 of the line. Back to you guys. Thank you for that report, Miss Denise Stan, but that time around off a timeout. Hey, CJ. CJ finds an opening and he scores on back to back layups. Miranda falling asleep yeah. uh, a bit uh, on a couple of uh, defensive possessions here. Two layups coming from CJ Perez. Yeah, it comes to that, yeah. Newsom, again, he needs to step up and lead the offense, and he provides them with a much needed conversion from the outside. Oh, almost a steal. Yes, it will be a thing. Discussion earlier, the half-court defense has been good for Meralco. Yes. But you mentioned this guy needs to score, and he did. Goes on the attack. Jumper is good. Great job by Newsom to create some uh, separation against the defense of CJ. Doing exactly what the team needs from them, and that will be the end.
of game number five. The result, a win for the San Miguel Beerman. Meralto will have to look at all the missed opportunities. They were right in this. Only down by...